Hey Virgo, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be seeing what's coming in for you throughout the next 48 hours. Okay, y'all, I am super happy to be back. All right. Um, and yeah, I'm not going to do too much talking. I'm just going to get straight into it. Okay, so let's see what's coming in with your person. How are they feeling about you or how will they be feeling about you throughout the next 48? So Spirit, please give me a reading or show me the energy give me a reading <laughs> show me the energy of S virgo's por oh, portion what show me the energy of virgo's person throughout the next 40 hours <laughs> what's the energy of virgo's person throughout the next 40 hours how are you feeling about them okay so we have the king of swords some of you guys be dealing with the gemini libra aquarius Nine of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, the Four of Swords, Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, the Moon, Pisces energy we have, or someone could have Pisces energy, it's strong Pisces in their chart, Four of Pentacles, Okay. The Knight of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune. Okay, so the first card we have here is the King of Swords. Okay, you guys. So someone here is being very strategic about something that they're about to do. <laughs> okay, that's what I'm going to say. Someone here got something up their sleeve. Someone here is being very smart. All right. Um, and they are ready to do something here. Okay, this could be anything. But this person is very nervous. They are hiding this from you. They have a fear about doing this. Okay. Um, with the moon. All right. I feel like it could be some type of communication that they are wanting to tell. They're wanting to express. They're wanting to speak to you with about. Um, I feel like this person is ready, you know, to explore something with you is what I'm hearing. Okay, we got the Nine of Cups. So maybe this person wants to tell you that you make them really happy with the Nine of Cups. Like you are their wish fulfillment. Okay, you make them very happy. You are someone who they really want to be with. Okay. The Four of Swords. Yeah, I feel like this person is holding back. All right, this reading is similar to, was it? I think it was Taurus. It was either Taurus or Leo, you guys. So some of you guys who are dealing with either a Taurus or a Leo, you could go check out those readings I just posted, okay? Um, but I feel like this person is holding back, you guys. They're holding back. They're not telling you this. They're keeping their feelings hidden. They're keeping their what they want to say to you hidden okay they're not going for it they're not taking the action they're not doing it okay this person is just you know pulling back their energy and they're they're moving very slow okay we got the knight of pentacles this person is moving very slow they're taking their sweet time okay maybe it's because this person is wanting to do it right they not they don't want it to be in a rush is what I'll say because I do feel like this person with the King of Swords is, you know, being very strategic. So this person is, you know, they're being very serious about how they are going to come towards you, what they're going to say to you towards you. This person is not trying to make no mistakes about the way that they're going to take action towards you. Okay, Virgo. Um we got the queen of pentacles here. This person feels like you are all about your money, your finances. This person feels like you are stable, you're grounded, your money look, it look, oh my gosh, I kind of cannot speak today, you guys. <laughs> I'm sorry, I cannot speak today. Um, What was I saying? This person feels like you are all about your money. You look really good to this person, okay? Um. We have the Wheel of Fortune. This talks about a change, a new cycle, a new beginning, okay? Leaving out the old, coming in with the new. 
all right and this person wants to come towards you they want you virgo okay they want you and they're serious about this because they've been coming up with a plan and and an idea about how they are going to either express express this towards you or how they are going to you know tell you this or it, it can even be you guys that this person is just nervous okay it's like this person has so much feelings for you that they're holding back and they're afraid to tell you this they could feel like you may not feel the same way or like you may reject them okay and that could be another reason why we have the moon here you guys because this person could have a lot of fear that if they was to come towards you you will reject them and that could be a reason why we have the knight of pentacles as well because they're moving very slow and they're not, you know, <laughs> they're not coming in fast because, you know, they're afraid that you may reject them if they was to tell you and confess their feelings for you, you know, and that could be a reason why they're moving very, very slow. All right. But I do see that this person, I feel like eventually they will, they will come cut and clean to tell you their feelings and express to you that, you know, <laughs> they want a new beginning with you. All right, this can even this could be someone who's just gotten out of a relationship as well as what I'm hearing and they're ready to start a new one with you, okay? This person just wants you, Virgo. They are very attracted to you with the Queen of Pentacles. All right. So, yeah, that's going to be it for today's video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.